morning good afternoon good evening from wherever you're watching this from i hope you all are doing great from your respective places welcome back yet again to another video and to another story today being that death five i've been the fifth of november of the year 2024 americans are going to be voting and uh, you know very well that the battle is between two people. That's Kamala Harris and Donald Trump. And uh, you know where we stand or where I stand. I wish I was a voter there. Kamala Harris would have gotten my vote very early. That aside, just imagine, you know, journalists from the UK were ferried from uh, the uk to the us for god knows what probably they were going to spy and see if uh you know probably duchess megan will be spotted out going to vote together with harry or something of the sort and um camilla Tomini posted herself while on the plane uh, saying that you know what off to washington dc to cover the u.s election for a telegraph and uh, at a daily tea podcast and uh, she went ahead and told people that you know what tune in for first episode monday 5 p.m and the rate at which people are kind of just on her comment section saying of how they don't want her there because of course she got nothing to cover she's just going to be gossiping around and uh, you know giving out lies because they are so much waiting for donald trump to win because they know or they think that you know what once that happens harry will be deported they said it themselves so that's one amongst the reasons as to why they are so much advocating for donald trump to win and that's where they go wrong Somebody said, we don't want her head here. She needs to keep racist, has racist. She needs to keep racist self on her damned shores. People don't want her. People have seen what she's been able to do. She doesn't report true news. All they do is hate. All they do is portray racism the comment section i bet at some point she probably had to kind of just block they kind of my thinking huh? somebody also went ahead and said she's itching uh, to move here like most brits journals she wants to be like a medi but for uh, the hf maybe that's her land royal drama no longer cuts at its gossip Politics is the bigger boys at club. Somebody's perspective. That's a message to Camilla. Tommy. They need to just stay on their aisle. Their toxic aisle. Because I bet people have heard enough of them. People have seen what they are capable of. And people are just like, you know what, we don't need or want her demented kind here. People don't want any person of the sort over there. I don't know what you're thinking, but I just went through the comment section as I was laughing myself. Because I'm like, uh, what's next? What's next? Because these people are being refused. People are refusing them globally because it looks like a British media can't afford even a business class according to the picture that she took. That's somebody's perspective. People have noticed that she is using economy and not business class. Crazy. I know. I know. And why is she even going, you know, to... To a country where she doesn't belong. More so now that it is election time. She's not a journalist over there. All that suits them is nothing but royal drama. Which they don't cover. They themselves, they don't even cover their own political issues. 
it's so crazy how they've decided to just uh, you know focus so hard speaking of so hard on harry and megan's lives and everything they do and trust me it's gonna land them where they don't lie Somebody said, uh, no wonder them people hate Harry and Meghan. They are miserable in the UK. Journalists over there are miserable. She's She's got a whole prince to cover in South Africa, but she's coming here. She should be going to cover up William. And now that you know, he has been known to be a slam lord. But they haven't covered that. Not the Daily Mail hasn't published it. It hasn't been classed in any UK media magazine on the front page. That's crazy. I don't know what you're thinking, but I'm just like, you know what? Well, 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 they better get ready to be shocked. Camilla has just shown how obsessed as a person she is as an individual she is obsessed very much desperate for attention somebody commented and said with all those lies as she report for the telegraph one would think she could afford to fly business class instead of coach oh god she's getting what she deserves she's getting what she deserves such comebacks are what she deserves somebody else is saying why are they disgusting why are these uh, disgusting people trying to bring their filth to america why have more than enough uh, not cases of our own to deal with we certainly don't need the brit idea of news which uh, is nothing but gossip on america besides uh, she has said a lot of anti-american bs like everything that's why you're always told like watch what you say because you would never know when it will get back to you when that lie you projected or said will hunt you back you never know look at this now look at this now i don't know what's your tech what's your thinking but camilla shouldn't have got it worst thing she wouldn't have I've posted it but she did it and looking at her comment section i just got myself laughing and laughing and laughing i don't know what's your tech what you have to say about this just let me know your thoughts on the comment section and hoping to see you guys in our next more videos to come